Hi, welcome to Parametric House. In this class of photo for beginners, I want to show you how you can uh, convert a series of B reps. As you can see, here, I have a box and a series of smaller boxes inside it. And then I want to get the difference between these two sets and also uh, put the surfaces into two outputs. So here at the end of the algorithm, you can see that we have two surfaces. Uh, I can bake that into layer one and also bake this into layer two and close Grasshopper. And in Rhino, you can see that these are in two different layers. Okay, now let's look uh, at another example. So for example, I'm going to select this uh, box for the first set and these spheres, scale spheres, the second set. And here you can see that I can see the output if I change the location, the rotation, you can simply see the output. So if I scale that a little bit and get down. I will have the two surfaces. And again, I can bake that into layer one and layer two to have that in Rhino. So actually this uh, grass prototype for beginner is going to help you to understand uh, how to make a Boolean difference. And then we're going to talk about how we can extract the parts which is in the intersection and uh, also get the outer part of the polysurface. Okay, let's get someone from scratch. What I want to do here is to just uh, draw a box maybe and bring it a little bit up. Uh, also, we can draw a sphere at the center. We can bring that here and also make it a little bit bigger, maybe bring it down. And if you want to maybe just bring it out something like this, we can scale it, okay? So uh, I'm just going to use this as an example. We can also use other uh, solids. Maybe we want to add two spheres here, so it doesn't really matter. You can use anything you want. And just copy this with an Alt. Bring it here, okay? Uh, now I'm going to go to the menu, geometry, and I'm going to use the B-Rep. This is going to be the se uh, first set of the B-Rep, so right-click and set it here. And we're going to use the Control c Control v to copy this. Uh, right-click and set multiple B-Reps and select these as the uh, second set. Uh, okay, now to get the results, what I want to do is to go to the intersection menu. And in the shape, you can see that we have the solid difference component, which is really easy to use. You just have to use this solid difference, give the first set to A, second set to B. And if I bake this, uh, you can see that we will have that as an output, okay? To get a clear view of how the result is changing, I'm going to move this solid difference a little bit forward. So uh, you can just search for move, 